What's happening everybody? Welcome back to another FIFA 23 Brighton Hope Album Career Mode. Hope you're all having a great day. It's your boy DB. Now, just want to say a huge thank you everyone for uh, hitting the like buttons on the last episodes. If you're enjoying these episodes, hit that like button before we start this video. Uh, subscribe if you want to for sure. Uh, but yeah, I'm much appreciated for everyone who's watching these videos at the moment um and yeah i'm hoping to uh put out some more videos soon two thousand years later now back with the career mode stuff a pretty interesting uh episode last uh, um eddie and ketia pretty much uh shining um and uh also getting knocked out of the fa cup by wolves so yeah um that was interesting uh so no more fa cup if i speak i am in in big trouble in big trouble and i don't want to be in big trouble but our main focus right now is the premier league transfers are officially done and we literally haven't got much really to do for the rest of the season apart from uh getting top five top six maybe hopefully uh be realistically even though we are top four at the moment um but yeah as you can see we got arsenal next um where we left off last episode that's going to be a bit of a challenge. What have we done, sorry, uh, whilst we have been away since the last video? Um, we put some development plans on a couple of players. But enough of the jibber jabber. Let's get into the uh, career mode series. Right, so we got Arsenal next, obviously, at, uh, at the Emirates. Uh, we do, and we want to play a really good team against Arsenal. Because we uh, have got not really a busy month. So we can don't need to really rotate that much, but um, let's get into the teams. Right, so um, obviously, as you can see, uh, we've changed a little bit of the team um, since the last uh, FA Cup game. Um, this is kind of like our first team at the moment that we can more rely on at the moment uh, in games. So we've got Undav up front with Trossard and McAllister, uh, with Gross and Caicedo in the middle. Esther Pinnant, Webster, Dunk, Veltman and Lapiti on defence and Sanchez in goal. Um, now, it's difficult because I want to play Eddie Nketiah, yeah? but because his, his form is brilliant. But I don't know if I want to kind of start playing him just yet, just like Castor, because they have been playing a lot better since uh, uh, signing him, well, especially Castor, I should say. Um, so, yeah, um, I, th I think we'll leave him on the bench. If anyone has any difference in what i think let me know we could try again uh but yeah we've got van heck colwell cast up moda gilmore Matoma, and eddie and Ketia. now the thing with billy gilmore is he has been playing phenomenal for us phenomenal solo runs playmaking scoring goals wow just unbelievable um so yeah we need to we need him on the bench for sure uh so that's pretty much the teams uh at the moment Right now, getting into the in, into the uh, match now. Obviously, let's have a look at the Arsenal team. Uh, they got Ramsdale goal, Tomiyasu on the right, White Gabriel in the middle, and Sosa on the left with uh, Partey and Kondogbia in the defensive midfield. And then you got Saka, Odegaard, and Martinelli uh, behind Jesus. So obviously, Kondogbia and Sosa are pretty much new in there. So we we got. Uh, think of uh, ways to get around uh Saka as well so yeah um all right no worries uh let's uh get into the game I guess right here we go first game of the day at the Emirates uh, against Arsenal the Gunners now last time we played these was a couple of episodes ago it could have been last episode uh we got uh an exciting uh game we did so hopefully it's another. We gotta watch out for Jesus and Odegaard. Um, but they got a bit of a different team uh, in the midfield and defence. So uh, yeah, we'll see what happens. All right, so here we got Esther Pinnell wins the ball and sees Pascal Gross to Caicedo, who sees Undav and Undav could be in here. Has a pop and he beats Ramsdale easily. And there it is, one nil straight away at the Emirates in the lead. Great start. Let's go. Right. Dennis Undav, 20 goals in 27 matches. He's killing it this season. Absolutely destroying it. Let's get some more. 
Ah, oh, Esther Pinner and Unlucky Mate. Webster's the only one left. See Jesus and Jesus has hit the post, luckily. Arsenal on the pool with Odegaard. Oh, he's done well there, Martinelli. Don't let him in, and we let Thomas in. Thomas party uh, just before half time. Scores a goal. A defense is getting killed there by Odegaard, as always. So, yeah, 1-1. Um, one, one. Right, Thomas Party, three goals, 25 matches. The captain for Arsenal. Right, it's probably going to be half time now. There you go, yeah. So, one goal apiece, as he said, uh, at the Emirates for the first half. Um, defense let us down there. They've done well all game and let them in. So, yeah, let's uh, go to the next uh, half. Right, second half on the way. Arsenal kicking off. Got to play a lot better. Well, not play a lot better, but defend a lot better, I should say. Um, against uh, that Arsenal final third. Trossard on the ball against his club. Undav. McAllister. Caicedo. There we go. Ramsdale with a great save there. Unlucky. Right, some subs going on. Right, McAllister and Caicedo off for Matoma and Moda. I think Arsenal might make some subs as well, but that's ours. Right, we've got to play a lot better now. Um, I'm a bit worried that they will score soon. Oh, that's why. Jesus defending. Oh, Odegaard 2-1. I told you it was going to happen. Oh, he's, our defence just keeps pushing forward a little bit. I don't know, it only happens against Arsenal. 2-1. Right, 2-1, Odegaard scores. Oh, it's going to be another draw, isn't it, against Arsenal. Right, Jesus on the ball. I, I hate when he's on the ball, because this happens. He sees Odegaard, and Odegaard is just wasted a chance like that. Why would FIFA let him do that? It's absolutely ridiculous, FIFA. When are they going to fix that? Alright, we see Undav. Oh, he slides it under Ramsdale nicely. That, I, see, I don't know if we can take him off now. He scored a second, could get a hat-trick. 2-2. Two -two. Right, 2-2. Two -two. Undav scores in the 84th minute. Two minutes out of time. This is it. I, that was quick. I didn't expect that to go quick. Undav, last chance of the game on the ball. Oh, come on. Matoma's there, but oh, he's just out. Just, oh, he just ruined it, Matoma. Why are you running into the net? Go to the ball. Jeez. Oh, oh man, that's annoying. That's frustrated. Uh, another draw against Arsenal. 2-2. Two -two. Um, yeah. All right, well, we've got more games to go. Um, we'll take it on the chin. Uh, on to the next. Right, so, yes. We draw against Arsenal yet again. Um, as you can tell, I'm not really too fond of it. Um, but it's FIFA. It's the game. But, um, yeah, as you can see, Denison and Dave have a tremendous uh, season already. More goals to come. I wouldn't be surprised. Right, so as you can see, we have Man City oh, at home actually next. Uh, we are two points away from them, wherever they are in the league. In fact, we'll actually have a look now. So they are in third, as you can see, uh, with uh, 52 points. Um, if we win, we go ahead. So that's, uh, that's back to third, I'm guessing. But yeah, uh, let's go look at the squads. Right, so here is the team for the moment. So, we have Undav up front, Trossard, McAllister up front as well. <clears throat> with Caicedo and Gross in the middle. Now, we've put Karstorp, uh on the right t today for Man City just because of strength-wise. Uh, Estepinen as well with Webster, Dunk and Velvin and Sanchez the goal. So, nothing really changes apart from the card stop. Uh, Van Heck, Cole, Lapti's on the bench at the moment with Moda, Gilmore, Matoma and Eddie and Ketier. Right, the uh, Man City team. Right, they've got Edison and goal with Rico Lewis and Cancelo on the wings. Laporte and uh, Diaz in the uh, back. We have Rodri, De Bruyne and Gundogan uh, in the midfield. Morris, Haaland and Foden up front. 
gonna be a, a hard one to keep Haaland out, I'll tell you that. Um, but let's get into the game. Right, here we go. Live from the Amex. Brighton v Man City. Here we go. Alright, we need some movement. And we see Undav down the middle on the run. Can he defeat Diaz? Yes, he can, but Edison gets to it. What a save. And there's a shot. Great save by Sanchez. Alright, we win the ball back by Casido. Gives it away again. We've got to stop doing that. We've got to stop doing it. Giving it away constantly. It's not great. Dunk. Ah, what is going on? Lucky is half time. But we're getting pressured a lot now in defence by Man City. We've got to be a lot better in the second half. Right, Man City kicking off. Haaland to do it. Alright, not the best first half of the game, but it is a big club. I wouldn't be surprised with results like these against Man City, Arsenal, top clubs like them. Alright, we're on the ball with Trossard. Trossard shoots, Edison saves. Not the best shot. Let's get a counter going. Trossard down the middle. Sees uh, Estepinen on the wing. Maybe we get it to the wrong person. Trossard shoots. And he's at the bar. So unlucky. So unlucky. All right. Gross on the ball. Sees uh, Estepinen. All right. Trossard in here. Go on. Run. Run at him. Yes. 1 0. Let's go. Trossard with a shot towards Eden. Right, Trossard with 8 goals in 26 matches on the 75th minute. Not the greatest of goals, but we're in the lead 1-0. Awesome. Right, we're also making some subs. Um, we're bringing on Gilmore, Eddie, and uh, Mitoma. Uh, all McAllister coming off. Uh, Undav, and I believe it was uh, Gross. So, yeah. A uh, bit of freshen up things a little with Eddie. Hopefully he can come on and score. Like he does. What a save by Sanchez to keep the uh, Haaland out. All right, Eddie sees uh, Karstorp. What can Karstorp do here? Karstorp's in and misses. All right, not the best at shooting the aim. He was a right mid. Ike Gundogan coming on for... Bur oh, Bernard Silva coming on for Ike Gundogan. Um, he's not happy. Eddie on the ball now. Sees Esther Pinnant. Back to Eddie. Eddie! Oh, so unlucky. Oh, and there it is, the final whistle. I thought Eddie was going to do it again. It's just off the post, but great save. We beat Man City 1 0 at the Amex Stadium. Brilliant result for us. With a great win there, to be honest. Um, very unlucky uh, Haaland ha has been today. But yeah, let's go. Right, so Man City get a big defeat there against us. 1-0. Um, getting a clean sheet as well. Awesome. Um, we beat Man City twice this season. Yeah, we beat Man City uh, twice this season. Uh, great result. Um, yeah. Yeah. Uh, all Trossard there, to be honest. Eddie unlucky out of the final minutes. And I'll, I'll give Karstop a, a, a pat on the back as well. He done extremely well there. Right, as you can see, uh, we've sent the youngster Diego TX area uh, on loan to Mould. Um, we've accepted a one-year loan. Uh, but that won't happen till the start of uh, next season. So, uh, yeah, hopefully he does well. Right, so... Um, I've realised we have a heck of games that are big that we need to play. Manchester United next. Wow. Um, well, Arsenal, Man City, and now United. We've drawn one, one, one. Uh, I'm hoping this ain't going to be a loss, but um, we'll give it our best and we'll see where it goes. Right. So, uh, Manchester United next. This is the team we're going to play. Right, so this team we're to play against United. Uh, we got uh, Undav, Matoma, and Trossard all up front with Gilmore and Modar. We've changed the midfield a little bit. Um, I would, I just, like I said last game, Caicedo, I don't think he's ready at the moment. 
Um, Gilmore, I feel like he's playing a lot better games. Um, but I wanted to give Moda a couple of games as well. So, yeah. Um, apart from that, Lavt is back in the team with Estepunen. Webster, Dunk and Veltman, as always, at the back. And Sanchez in goal. Van Heck, Colwell, Karstorp, Caicedo, Gross, McAllister and Eddie and Ketia all on the bench. Uh, no change really for Eddie and Ketia just yet. Hopefully soon. Um, I just don't want to ruin his stats, honestly. Uh, but yeah, let's go check out the uh, United game. Right, so Man United team. Obviously, you're going to see some names there that uh, ain't pretty much with the team anymore. But yeah, De Gea, Delot, Varane... Martinez Shaw, all at the back with McTominay and Casemiro at the defensive midfield role. Sancho, Fernandez, and Anthony mid uh, behind Ronaldo, really. Um, wow, okay, Ronaldo's still there. Jeez, okay. Um, not much to say, let's just get straight into the game. Right, another game at the Amex Stadium against a big club, Manchester United. Hopefully we get the win, not the loss. Uh, so we've drawn one, one one, and uh, this is the third game. So we'll see what it says. Corner to Man United. There they go. Give it short, no doubtly. Yeah, Anthony Gilmore tries to win it. Oh no! Oh, Sancho on the ball. Come on! What a save by Sanchez. No, I couldn't get no one on it. And there it is, half time. Nil nil. Not the best of starts to this game. Nil nil. Uh, second half to come. Right, here we go. Second half. Let's hope for a better one. Alright, Gilmore. This is Moda. Right, we need Laverty to make a run. Laverty's gone past uh, McTominay. Oh, what a goal! Undav has won it back and just finessed it straight in top bins. What a goal. 1-0. Let's go. Alright. 22-29 now. He's back. His form's back now. Let's go. Alright. We'll try to intercept it with Sancho on the ball. Oh. We need to do it. Sancho's going to get past him. Could be a red. What's it going to be? He's gone down last man, maybe. Yeah, there it is. Webster. No, sorry, Lewis Dunk getting his first red of the season. Had to be done. Right, making some changes. Subs coming off. Got to get another centre back on there. So we've taken uh, Matoma off and put uh, Colwell on, I believe it was. Just need to get five at the back again. Right, we get ball back. Ronaldo is giving it to Trossard. Trossard could be on his own here. And he is, it looks like it, and he's ruined it. He's ruined it, he's bottled it. God's sake, that was appalling. Gilmore on the ball, gives it to Trossard again. 2 0, let's go. And he wins it back. Gilmore helping Trossard to get another goal there. Brilliant play, 2 0. Let's go. There we go. 2 0, 69th minute, Trossard. Now we are doing well. Those subs helped a little. Alright, sees Trossard. Sees uh, Gross. And uh, with the finesse. What a goal, 3 0. We are all over Man United now. And uh, chasing them goals like he did at the start. Right, 3 0. Game on. 78th minute. Man United are being scalped right now. Scalped. Alright. Karstop has won the ball back. Sees uh, Undav. Trossard shoots. Ah, oh, it just goes over the bar. So unlucky. United uh, make a sub. Delot. Christian Eriksen. Could change the game a little bit. You never know. But I don't think they're going to come back from this in the 87th minute. Three minutes at a time. All right, we see Undav on the wing. Uh, Undav has probably maybe done it there. Oh, no, he hasn't. Scott McTominay beats the height of Billy Gilmore and sees uh, Ronaldo. Sancho on the ball, threads it back, and that's it. Full time, 3-0. We get 10 men down. But, yeah, uh, great result against United. What a result. I don't think we're going to win it, to be honest. 
But we stopped there, we conquered them, and we've done it. 3 0, let's go. Right, so great result there against Man United for us. What a result. Three big games, two wins, one draw, no losses, um, and two clean sheets. Great result for now. And Dav with some tremendous goals at the moment, keeping Eddie alert. What a signing that was. Uh, but yeah, right. So, uh, as you can see, we got Fulham next to a 34 points on the board let's see where they are so manchester united we've actually given a gap a little more spread for liverpool to get past them um but for some reason man city have gone ahead of us don't know how maybe it's to do with played games but yeah um we're doing well sitting fourth 56 points but where are fulham fulham are 14 for 34 points minus 18 goal difference so they haven't got the best defense uh so we might be able to rotate the team a little right so we have changed the team around a little bit just to give some game time to players now obviously with uh donk suspended uh we've obviously had to rotate a little of the center backs as well so here's the team for now we are officially giving eddie and ketia a full debut um up front with matoma and trossard next to him gilmore and gross in the middle with Esther Pinnon and Karstorp out wide. With Colwell, Webster and Veltman in the back. And Sanchez in goal. On the bench you've got Van Heck. Uh, this guy here. Solly March, Caicedo, Moda, Sarmiento and Fofana. Uh, we put Fofana on. He needs some game time. He, he's quality man. Honestly. He is a quality striker. Uh, Undab and uh, McAllister. I'm not making the trip. We're going to give them a rest. Um, we're trying to give everyone a game. Um, as you can see, Solly March, Fafana and Sarmiento, they're all in bad sharpness. So I don't know if that's going to affect it today. Um, so yeah. So let's have a look at the Fulham squad. They've got Rodak uh, in goal with uh, Mbambu, Reem, Diop and Kurzawa. Uh, all at the back with uh, William, Chalabar, Paulina, Solomon and uh, Carney in the midfield. With Mitrovic up front, Super Mitrovic um we are gonna sim this game just to let you know uh we're at home hopefully we get a decent result uh but yeah let's go and sim it right so as you can see we lost to fulham 2-1 at home not the best of simulations we've had this season but um we scored first with trossard seventh minute then six minute william came back and then it was half time uh, they made a change, James or William, uh, Mitrovic scored, obviously. And then we thought we changed the formation to help, see if it helped. Uh, bringing on Fofan and Caicedo. Didn't really do much, Caicedo, we kept passing it and giving it away, as always. Um, but they held the lead 2-1. We didn't really have any opportunities in the second half, I'll be honest with you. As you can see, one shot, one chance. That's that one goal that we scored. Uh, possession, we got outbeaten. Fulham were all over us. Eight shots, four chances. But yeah, um, can't happen that. Can't happen again. Can't happen again. Right, so yeah, disappointing game that was on the sim. We lose uh, a game um, this month. So that was two wins, one draw, one loss. Um, yeah, pretty good still, uh, I think. Um, but apart from that, um, we've sent two youngsters out on loan. One of them was Antef one who's gone on loan to Philadelphia for uh, one year next season. And obviously the other guy was uh, TX Area, who's gone to Mould for the season. Hopefully um, when that season starts, they do well. So that's that. We've obviously sent some players out on loan, um, which is going to be very good to see at the start of next season. Um, but apart from that, that will probably be the end of this episode for today. I feel we've done well today, to be honest. But yeah, if you enjoyed the episode, hit the like button. Uh, subscribe if you want to, and we'll catch you next episode. Peace.